There was really only one option from the very beginning. Ah. Hello everyone, welcome once again to Point of View. Where it seems the good guys versus the bad guys is, of course, a point of view. Which means I can say that everything is true from a certain point of view. Eh. Gotta love that line. Everything is true from a certain point of view. Surveillance complex. Ah, here we go. What the? What's going on here? Oh, neat. Can't wait to see what that did. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, nice. Right, I gotta remember. Headshots. I keep forgetting that, somehow. I mean, it's easy to for it's easy to not realize that lightning is somehow more effective in the head than the chest. Because you'd think the heart would be more susceptible. I've never heard of someone's brain short-circuiting. I mean, I guess it's possible if you got struck by lightning or something, but odds are your heart would stop instead. Yeah, forget it. Oh boy. Oh boy. There we go. Now that is more like it. Oh, that did you a lot of good, didn't it? Running away. Way to go. Brick. Way to go. So much better. Huh. I guess I just have to look for the open doors, huh? Because there aren't any that are opening. Not to my knowledge, anyway. Yeah, it seems these doors aren't gonna open. You can either find the ones that are capable of opening, or you can just go screw yourself. Dark leader, how does it breathe? Okay. Right. There were none left. Okay. There were none left to read at the moment. I mean, that's fair. What the? Just all closed doors. Now what do I do? I guess I'll just sit here and die. Ah, just kidding. This might help me see a little. Oh, okay. These are lockers, I see. Weird how everything is repeated so much, but I guess it makes sense. They've untexted your memory and all that. Seriously, it just makes everything a confusing labyrinth. I honestly don't know where it's supposed to make me go. Huh. Oh. Different looking door. Go figure. Uh oh. I'm suspicious. Indeed, I changed my name to unnamed again. Even though it's been doing that since I started. Real shame the Vortigaunt can't fit in that. That would be great, wouldn't it? Oh, nice. You can shoot me all you want. All I need is one good clean headshot. And you're down, pal. Oh wait, what the hell? It's a different one. Ah, I almost thought I was backtracking there for a second. I was like, what? I right, know, high radiation area. This might not be good for my health. Although Vortigaunts might be immune to radiation, I don't know. Caution. We must throw caution to the winds. What the? Okay. Cool. That is a non-standard door, which means it opens. 
Them's the rules, baby. Oh, wait, but that's... That looks like the same door as that one, too. Oh, well, I guess the ones that just look different are the ones that are good. The ones that are glowing with something, I guess? I don't know. I don't know what the rules for this universe are in terms of what doors open what. If you ask me, it all seems like a bunch of random crap anyway. So what do I know? Well, I had to load something. Maybe that means I was supposed to go here. Or it means I actually am backtracking now. Yep. I must go forward. Never back. Half-Life may be a more story-involved game, but it usually doesn't involve backtracking to that level. Unless they make it obvious. But... There wasn't anything that obviously registered as... Okay. Ah, shit. That was my bad. That was my bad. Uh-oh. I gotta be more careful here. Darn it. I don't remember where I went. Maybe this way? Nope, that's not the way. Um... Maybe this way? Yeah, it had to have been this way. I think I remember now. Darn it. I'm a little too eager to shoot something. I have become much like the humans. There we go. Now isn't that more like it? And of course an armory full of weapons I can't use because I do not have human physiology. Blasted humans. What it again. My throat's about to be thwarted again if I keep talking like that. In fact, I think it already is. Let's talk with a bit of a deeper voice that's easier on my throat. But with not a raspy voice, just a deep-throated voice. You know, like Duke Nukem. Yeah, it sounds more kick-ass anyway. Let's go for it. Oh, where the hell am I supposed to go? I can help myself see with night vision, but it doesn't exactly show me where to go here. Oh, wait. Regardless of what similarities our two species may share, this place is an absolute maze to me. Each section is the same prefabricated chunk, yes, all interconnected as needed. Most of the entries don't even open, they've been sealed shut to contain each other area even further. How the humans could possibly navigate such a place without the aid of chemical communication or telepathy is beyond me. It reminds me of the human facility I was in earlier, but taken to a much more drastic extent. Prefabrication seems to be the driving force behind their construction efforts. An unusual development, but to be expected from creatures that broke with the natural order. Our facilities are built around the strengths and weaknesses of each particular area. And as such a much more structurally sound, we can adapt because we are malleable, unlike humans. Little good my malleability does me now, though. I cannot even rely on the XTBS's trail. The humans possessing it took a completely different route. All I have is a vague sense that they're moving quickly, trying to slip away from me. Hmm, it appears those colored marks on the walls indicate a clear path to this complex. If I follow these, maybe I can get out of here and get on with my task. And maybe I should have read that sooner. Heh. <laughs> Does what I know, doesn't it? Where are the colored markings on your walls? Then a red- this is in red lighting. How am I supposed to find my way through here? He probably mentioned that a long time ago, and I'm just now getting to it. Although, I'm pretty sure this is the right way. At least I think so. I could be completely off, though. Hmm. Power generator. Maybe the XTBS is that way. Like, straight up. I have no idea. Was that the thing that he was looking for? 
I do not know. XTBS. Is that the thing? I honestly don't know. It's a power generator. Hmm. I don't know if I'm actually supposed to be doing anything, let alone that. Hmm. Darn it. Well, that's not helping. That's not helping the slightest. I mean, it's not hurting, but it's wasting my time. My time is precious. <laughs> nah, but seriously, I need, I need to quit wasting my time. Ah, beautiful. Isn't that just great? Now where do we go? Who knows? Oh, here we go. When you find enemies, that has to be it. Ah, darn it. Huh. Neat. Jackass. Take that, bitch. What do you say to me now? Why do I hear frog sounds? Oh boy. Why was that one running away from me? Probably trying to flank me. Not doing a very good job at it because we have much more accurate aim. Well, when I choose to. Hello. Don't mind me, human. Oh no. Oh no, what? Oh, yeah. You should consider yourself grateful. I'm treating you with far more kindness than you would have ever treated me. Ungrateful humans. They always just got to assume the worst of everyone, don't they? Just because they're monsters doesn't mean I am. What the? Okay, this is a new area. Oh, this is great. Oh, jeez. This is weird. It's almost weird how much easier it is. Oh, boy. I think I'm weaker. Ah, shit. Okay, so they haven't gotten that much weaker. I can still sustain a lot of damage if I'm not careful. Maybe I'm just getting more careful here. Oh, darn it. Yeah, gummit. Oh. This guy's just unaware. Or his AI's busted. Say hello to a free infinite healing station. Heh <laughs> heh heh. And yes, I will use those to my advantage. I don't care. Don't mind me. You just keep dancing. Join me how Dr. D. They appear to be trying to move it away from me. Desperately. Don't those humans know anything? Oh, wait, right here. Surely that did something. Yeah. Now I just gotta be cleansed, I guess. Or I'll just die. That works, too. Deep bastard. Oh, boy. Oh boy. Damn you. Damn it. Take this. 
Oh boy. Distance is my friend. As our broken guard AIs. Let's see if he's still broken. Oh, uh, now he's not. Crap. Well, that was fun while it lasted. I was kind of hoping I could exploit that some more. I mean, one thing I thought of is maybe if I I could kill that scientist and get some health, but I don't want to do that. I don't want to resort to that. If I do that, we're no better than the humans. Killing merely to get ahead. Eh, it sickens me. The thought of it. That ah, crap. Self defense, however. Perfectly defensible. That's lawful, baby. I'm just exercising my rights to bear electric alarms, baby. Is this the XTPS or whatever it's called? Is it down there? It could very well be. I guess we'll find out, won't we? Darn it. There. Ooh. Very nice. As we make the great descent. I'm almost expecting title screens to appear. Or at least, what a thrill. When darkness and silence through the night. What a thrill. What the? Oh, no, 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 no. This is not what I was supposed to do. That's how you get back up. I'm supposed to go this way, aren't I? What a thrill. I'm searching the melt into you. This AI probably isn't very smart. More smart than I thought, though. Huh. Actually smart enough to not get caught in their own trap. But they will shoot at it. Thus ensuring its destruction. I guess it's better for them than risky getting destroyed by it, but even so, kind of silly. I die. Can't even see you. There you go. There you go. There we go, that's better. Now let's see what this says. I'm definitely on the right trail now, though the dark human in possession of the XDBS traversed the compound above with a different route. We're on the same path now, and I'm right behind it. It's only natural to try to hide deep underground beyond all the defenses just as my research was supposedly well hidden. Like then, however, they will find that no matter how deep they go, their enemies can still reach them. If however things get ugly, I can only hope that the other denizens can learn from all this. I don't mean that in any general sense, but quite literally being able to study my journey in detail. Just because super workers like myself are capable of leaving our thoughts behind after our passing. Though this advancement wasn't originally conceived of for this end, it is primarily for research purposes It does allow us to leave a legacy. I'm speaking of our wrist symbiotes. Unlike our collars, wrist symbiotes are only designed as faux -kay for our electrical attacks. In super workers, wrist symbiotes additionally serve as external storage units where we can record our thoughts. Everything that has occurred to me so far is embedded in these two symbiotes, and I will continue to do so until the ordeal is over one way or the other. Now I see... That's how it, this, that's what all of this is, isn't it? It's just his recorded thoughts. Clever. No, oh, really, that's pretty clever. Huh. For a top secret base, you gotta love how there's just vending machines up in front. I mean, yeah, even a secret base would probably want some refreshments, but still, it's kind of funny how that works. Oh boy. Damn. I should probably be more careful and not just hit them at point blank. Oh boy. Is that G-Man? Or is that Gordon? 
I think that might have been Gordon. Hmm. Welcome to Earth. Oh, cool. Interesting. It's like the opposite of what Gordon went through. Instead of going into Zen, I'm going into Earth. Cool. Don't mind me. Relax. I come in peace. I simply want what's mine. I hope you understand. Darn, I'm stuck here, aren't I? Oh no. Don't mind me. Or maybe you should mind me because maybe I gotta kill you to get out of here. I have no idea. Well, all routes are locked. Would one of you kind humans be so lovely as to let me out of here? My goodness. Fine. You don't want to help me? Then your bodies can serve as nourishment, baby. Hmm. Let's see. Oh wait. Whew, I made it through before they before they shut it down. The tricky little devil's trying to shape me out by jumping to some other point of zit. Wait, the air here is much more sterile. And the gravity is heavier. No, I'm in the border world. This portal's taking me into the human realm itself. Well that's just great. It certainly complicates things. Now not only must I find the XTBS, but I must locate a Zenison attack force so I can find a portal to take me home. At the moment, however, it appears that I'm stuck here. I cannot merely sit around and wait for the humans to amass an attack force to wipe me out. Yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out some way of breaking out of here. Well, chem chemical communication was abandoned a long time ago. A strong sense of smell is an ability that has been continually passed down in generations. Right now, I'm picking up something that could be useful, this gas here. Sitting out of the wall smells flammable. Perhaps with enough of an bombardment, I can ignite it and blow my way out of this mess. Ah. Now I see. Interesting. Very nice. Oh, okay. That's all I needed. Just one. Can't get out. There we go. Guess that means I killed that scientist for nothing. Sorry, pal. Not sorry. He had it coming, the prick. Oh boy. That's weird though, it's kind of like they're working with on the same side as the scientists. Maybe something happened. I just want to get out of this alive. Hello. You keep dancing. Oh, oh. Sorry, pal. Don't take it personally. Oh boy. Oh jeez, throwing a grenade. Asshole. Oh boy. Well, at least my health was slightly higher than it was before. Oh jeez. Sure. If you keep dancing, I'm just gonna drain my health, health back from you. Sorry, pal. Not sorry. Again, you kind of had it coming. Okay, I'll be nicer. Even though I know I shouldn't be. Gonna screw me up in the long run, but whatever. I need to be nicer. I already killed one of them. Hmm. What do we have here? Can't see a damn thing. Oh. Huh. Neat. Right. Gotta find something here. 
I get the feeling all these doors are just gonna be a waste of my time and I need to keep moving forward. Or something. I don't know. Probably. Sorry, pal. But you did try to attack me. And even if it was a feeble and weak, feeble and useless attack, it was a sign of hostility. And that's my excuse. Ah, that one didn't say restricted access, you see. Out of my way. Don't get out of my way, I'm gonna kill you. No! I don't wanna die! If you just stay out of my way, I won't kill you. Deal? Deal. Oh crap. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. What a lot of damage here. Yeah. Can't even see the bastard just running around. Damn you, damn you, damn you, damn you, damn you. You know, I'm this close to killing you. I'm serious, I'm this close to killing you. And not even because of necessarily your fault. Because this guy's so annoying that I want to maximize my health against him. You should be grateful that I'm not going in on my urges. There we go, that's better. Okay. Damn. Damn it. This is getting bad. Very complicated to say the least. Oh boy. Given the fact that those enemies were on this side, that means I gotta keep going this way, I'm assuming. Oh jeez. Oh crap. Oh jeez. How are you able to see in this? I'd like to know how you can see in here. How can you see in this bullshit, huh? How can you even see right now? Let alone better than me. I swear, it's like they can see better than me. Damn it. At least my health is higher now. See how long that lasts. Oh boy. Damn it. I can't go for headshots in absolute darkness, how can I? I can guess, but that's about it. Oh boy. At least I know I'm hitting them. As long as my health goes up, I know I'm hitting them. Isn't too shabby. I'll try to avoid killing scientists beyond that one. You However, all hostility will be met in kind, of course. And I can't be held responsible if there just so happens to be casualties. Jackass. Oh boy. Well then. Works out for me, doesn't it? Eh. Wow. Weird. Anyway. Right, authorized personnel only. That means don't go there. Oh boy. Admittedly, that's a nice way of it. Knowing that you can't go there, even if it is a bit on the nose. Ah, there's the door. Authorized personnel only, huh? I'll show you. What even is the XTBS? I don't know. I guess I'll find out, won't I? Oh boy. Ah, okay. There was really only one option from the very beginning. 
unfortunately, I'm gonna have to say that is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like dancing. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and very pleasant day. Okay, whatever. See you later. If you like what you saw, you can find more of that in these videos right here. If you're a real junkie for video games like I am, then subscribe and hit that bell icon if you haven't already to get your next fix, and a like and a comment are always appreciated too.